Most of us have tried to lose weight at one time or another. For some, dieting alone isn't enough, though, and surgical help might be needed. With summer approaching, many may be wondering if surgical weight loss is an option. Joining us this morning from Baptist Health is a bariatric surgeon, Dr. Eric Paul, to explain. Welcome to you. All right, thanks for having me. Yeah, thanks for being here. First of all, tell us what bariatric surgery is. Well, bariatric surgery is um, simply a surgery to, that will help you uh, may, um, attain your weight loss goals. And many people would recognize uh, gastric bypass. That's mm -hmm. sort of the surgery that we're Yeah, we, uh, we do, in this country, we do three different uh, commonly operations, and uh, most of them are done laparoscopically. We do a laparoscopic gastric banding surgery. We do a uh, roux y gastric bypass surgery, and we do a uh, sleeve, what's called a sleeve gastrectomy. Right, and this is the, a type of surgery that isn't for everyone. Who would be a good candidate, though? Certainly not. Um, the, the types of people that qualify for bariatric surgery are uh, people whose BMI is greater than 35, and the BMI is the, the body mass index, uh, and it's a, it's, it's a basic calculation of your height and weight, uh, greater than 35, and they have two comor comorbidities, which are things like high blood pressure, diabetes, reflux, things that, of, of that nature, or if your, bari uh, if your BMI is greater than 40, mm. and you automatically qualify. And for many people, I mean, this is a life-saving surgery. Certainly. It, that, is, that is what I do uh, bariatric surgery for, is uh, to uh, combat the ravages of diseases such as high blood pressure and diabetes. Right. Um, talk about um, maybe some of the results that you've seen, some of the patients. How much weight have they been able to drop and how healthier are they because of this? That's, that's really the, the, the main focus, mm -hmm. is, is not how much weight they lose, it's how m much life they can gain. And um, it's, it's really a, a question of, of maintaining a healthy lifestyle and, um, and diminishing their comorbidities such as diabetes and high, and high blood pressure. I've personally uh, seen a patient that was on a humongous dose of, of uh, insulin uh, go from 400 units of Lantus insulin, which is a very strong-acting, long-acting insulin, uh, to one month after surgery being on 10 units of that, and then three months of surgery being off insulin, what, completely. Wow. And that, that, is, that is what I'm in this, this for, sure. is to, to treat diabetes. And, and there are so many people that we see who have these results like this, but there are some risks that go along with it. Certainly. Uh, it, is, it is a semi-elective surgery, but uh, there are certainly risks that are associated with any surgeries. Um, and, it, and some of the risks and some of the, the complications of bariatric surgery can be severe. However, um, it is a very commonly per performed surgery, uh, all these different types of surgeries, and they have excellent safety profiles and people do very very well and I would imagine that that you meet with the patient before and consult with them and certainly. make sure they are aware of everything certainly we we have a, a three-tiered program where you come to an informational seminar and I give the basics of bariatric surgery then they meet with me in my office and then uh, we plan what type of surgery would be uh, appropriate for that person and then we plan the surgery then we do the surgery so right, and um, I mean, where is is this performed? Is it in the hospital? Is it an outpatient? Certainly. Um, it, currently, uh, I I practice at one of the uh, two bariatric centers of excellence in the mm. state, and Baptist Health Medical Center is is the only center of excellence in Central Arkansas, and so we perform uh, our bariatric surgeries at Baptist Health. Right. Is there is there um, anything you would say to patients who are maybe considering this, who really need it, and maybe need a little nudge to 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 make that phone call and get more information about it. Well, um, I, I just would would press them to look at how they're living. Mm -hmm. Are they happy? I mean, it, uh, this is not a cosmetic surgery. I'm not going to make them beautiful, but I'm going to make them feel better. Their joint pain. They're they're having to go to the doctor all the time uh, for management of their medical problems. Um, just I would just have them evaluate their lifestyle and if, if it's something that's actually making them happy. Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks so much for all of your advice today and the information. Thanks we really appreciate me. it. We want to put the uh, number up for Baptist Health. If you have any more questions about this, maybe this is something you've been considering, you can always call 1-888-BAPTIST. That's 1-888-227-8478.